For those planning to shoot fireworks at home this 4th of July weekend, medical professionals are asking you to be cautious. Not doing so could lead to serious injuries, specifically in your eyes. ABC 3340's Kyra Purvis joins us now. And Kyra, these kinds of injuries can lead to permanent eye damage. Muriel, experts tell me the eyes are one of the most vulnerable organs in the body. The chemicals released while setting these fireworks off at home could get into the eye and lead to permanent damage. Fireworks are inherently dangerous and even following all those safety instructions, there's always things that can go wrong. The Callahan Eye Hospital in Birmingham is preparing for an uptick in people visiting this 4th of July weekend. Shooting off fireworks at home can often lead to eye injuries and in some cases, permanent vision loss. It can lose the stem cells that are able to replenish that cornea and eventually people can need um, corneal transplants or even lose their eyes completely and have to have the eye taken out. McClure says this can come from chemicals inside of the firework. People think of the injury from the fire, you know, the fire burning the eye and burning the area around the eye, and that does happen, but often it's the chemical injury from the additives in the fireworks to give them that color and make them, you know, beautiful in the sky can also be more damaging to the eye than the actual heat from the firework itself. McClure encourages people to leave fireworks to the experts, but asks those who do choose to shoot them at home to wear proper eye protection. To stay on the safe side, Micah McMean says she'll only be watching fireworks done by the professionals. They're unpredictable, so if you are even, even you can be even as safe as you um, can possibly be, and if one decides that it's, you know, gonna not do what, what you expect it to do, it could, um, it could injure somebody. And the hospital's eye emergency room is open 24 hours a day. If you are in need of emergency eye attention, you are encouraged to go directly to that facility so you can be treated by an eye specialist. Stephen.